Well, okay, after all this business with the equipment, we finally get started. Okay, now, I am a room. I'm a room. I'm, uh, well, actually, you see me kind of through a rectangle, so I look kind of more square than I usually think of myself this way. <laughs> I'm usually not so square. I'm usually pretty far out. But okay, so what we got here? Now, I'm a room, a small room, and inside me... Apparently, at this moment, there are some furniture pieces, and um, there's a couple of people. Mm. Like I said, I'm not a big room, perhaps kind of a medium-small room. I don't have much of an echo, as you can hear. See, if I were a larger room, then I might have more of an echo. Let's see. I might have a... Let's see if I were a large room. If I were a larger room... Test, test, yep, that's it. Now I got my effects on. See, if I were a larger room, I would sound like this. Hello, I'm a large room. Sigh, but as life would have it, I'm a small room, medium small. So rather than build up any false expectations, I'll um, go back to my humble state with the effects knob here. Okay. I'm not the smallest room, but a medium small room. All right, now. Um, so as I said, I'm a room, and um, inside me are some people, two people. And, um, well, I'm an expressive room. I um, have lots of colors, you know. I have um, highlights. And I have some low colors also. Well... <laughs> Now, let's, um, let's be a little more specific. Now, as you can see, I'm in, uh, I'm in some kind of a neighborhood. Doesn't look like it's a very fancy neighborhood. Looks kind of like a slum, maybe, or some kind of shtetl or something or other. Maybe some old Russian town. You know, this guy Chagall painted me at some point, so maybe I'm in an old Russian town as it were, or be that as it may, or something like that. So, I'm, uh, now, do you hear that? That must be my wind blowing outside, or... Actually, it's my nose. Let's see, if I move a little closer to my, uh, to my... There it goes again. Oh, well, a little less now. Okay, so... So I'm a room. I keep coming back to that point. I'm getting used to the idea little by little, and I'm in this neighborhood. Outside, it looks like it might be nighttime. So, yeah, there's a little, there's light inside. I have some light in me. No? Look at this. I have some light. Now, I don't see any lamp, so perhaps it's, I don't know where the light's coming from. But uh, I have, uh, a moderate amount of light. It seems to be located mostly in one of my corners. Well, I wonder where that light is coming from. But um, now I feel good that I have some light in front of me, inside of me. If I were dark, I probably wouldn't have so much to say. But I got some light. Well, okay. So I'm a room and uh, I got colors. High and low, the colors sound of like anemic, but actually these colors are very bright. So let's, uh, let's hype up these colors a little bit. Now, let's see, what can we do with the colors, huh? Let's see what I can do with these colors. I know what I can do. Well, that's it. Oh, not so much color. I mean, I'm just, I'm just a room, you know. Well, let's calm it down a little bit. That seems about right. Now, something about my colors. <clears throat> I notice I have a lot of red in me. A lot of red. I'm a floor, and I have a certain amount of green in me and a certain amount of gray. That's mostly in my walls are gray, and my floor, what a floor. <laughs> get a low to my floor. I mean, you know, wow, look at that. 
Is that dirt or is that just paint? Hmm. I hear some background noise. Like the neighbor flushing a toilet or something? Well, I guess in Russia they had toilets. So, okay, so I am a room and next door to me is a toilet. Inside of me is some, some, some very, mm, maybe kind of special divine light or something. But next door is a toilet. And that's, that's life, isn't it? I already had an insight. Yep, I'm a special room, I guess, because I have a light inside of me. And uh, the toilet, even though the toilet is next door, it doesn't seem to phase me very much. I go on about being my special light. Hmm. I guess I can identify with that. <laughs> sure can, sure can, boy. You know, in this world we live in these days... New York, AIDS, and all that stuff. Well, anti-Semitism, right, got it. It's like a toilet out there, I'm telling you. And yet, and yet, in spite of that, I can find my, um, my inner light. Uh-huh. In fact, for a while, I was going to go back to Israel. But now, but now I have a life here. I seem to be finding my own light. So, okay, so I can identify with this room and the toilet next door. Now, what about this floor? Let's see if I can get into being my floor. My floor is the bottom. Tis, 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 tis. I am a red floor and I resonate because I have so much color. I am loaded with color. And I'm loaded with color. Why, you can walk all over me and dance on me, and I just come right into your feet. Really, I motivate you. Just look at these people. People, look at that. I'm giving you the energy. I'm really a hyped up floor. It's like that. I can go on forever, you know. I'm that kind of a floor. Well, to make a long story short, <laughs> gee, well, let's see. So if I'm a floor, very red, very red, and my voice is very deep and uh, mellow, mellow floor, I'm a deep red floor. I mean, even considering I'm such a small space, I managed a lot of residents. I mean, you were here. That kind of a floor. This floor experience, I resonate. I really fill up this little room. I can resonate like this little. I can resonate. I can resonate in this little hole in Brooklyn. I can resonate in a little room in Brooklyn. You hear that resonance? Well, so anyway, that's the floor. That's the floor. So like I said, I'm a room and all this stuff is happening inside me. But I gotta confess, sometimes just being a room that somebody once painted gets to be pretty boring. Like, look at those walls. My walls, man, they're just gray. And my ceiling, you can't see it, but it's just as well it's hidden. It doesn't look like it's very interesting at all. As a matter of fact, if it wasn't for my floor, if it wasn't for you, floor, people wouldn't even know I'm here. I'd be just like every other room and every other building in the whole world. Just look around at the rest of me and boy, if it wasn't for you, Floor, if it wasn't for those moments where you get this, <laughs> this, this, <laughs> whoo, this stuff going on, and you know, you just, mm, I'd get kind of depressed. Now, so let's have a, I mean, I don't really, you know, I don't really relate too well to the rest of you, room. Let me tell you, I mean, I'm the Floor, and I'm just like I'm special here. I'm really special. But it's nice hearing some of that appreciation from you every once in a while. You know, just being gray and boy, I can't even see my 
if I'm a wall here and I'm a ceiling, I look just like, like outside, like the rest of that toilet out there. So I have to kind of keep in touch with that red floor. And when the music stops, yuck, it's a bummer, you know, Lynn's in France, got herself a new boyfriend, and, uh, oh, got no job, 50 years old, etc., etc., you know, no kids, the whole scene, right? Like gray walls and a tiny old furnished room in Brooklyn, 275 a month, the landlord wants me out of here, got a neighbor next door, he has every word, that's why I talk so soft, you know, so anyway... So I'm these walls and the ceiling. I'm, I'm gray. No, that's not my music at all. I don't have any music at all. I'm just a, I'm just a verbal, just words. Let's see now. I don't even have any resonance either. So I'll turn off that resonance stuff. I don't have any effects at all. Let's see. Testing. Ah. Now nah, you see, that's it. A little room, no effects. No effects at all. Just a room. I'm just four gray walls and a ceiling, and I don't have... I don't even sound... I don't even have a low voice. I have just an ordinary voice. Yep. Testing, testing, testing. Hello, so it's Franklin. Franklin here in the room talking. I gotta talk. I can't talk loud because I don't want the neighbors to think I'm nuts here. But, you know, I'm here in this room and I got, well, I just got towels hanging there and I haven't done my laundry and I don't know how long. Just me and these four walls and <sighs> and life goes on somehow despite the fact that I'm 50 years old with no kids and Lynn's in France and I'm alone and nobody wants to work with me. God, three months, five months a year I'm advertising. Nobody wants to do gestalt process except me. Finally, I'll do it. All right, so, so maybe something will come of it anyway. So, like, it's a bummer. Now, hmm. But I got this other side. Man, ha <laughs> ho, that's my secret. That's your secret, huh, Floor? Like it's me and you, Floor. Now, I'm not like you at all, but I'm sure glad you're around. If it weren't for you as a foundation to stand on, man, hmm, I'd be a sad scene. My life, my existence... My function as four walls and a ceiling that are gray is just to be around, to make a living, and to to have kids, and to do, to do, to be a good bourgeoisie. Hmm. But with you, with you, 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 Floor, you, you drive me crazy. You drive me, you drive me, you drive me, period, all together. Yeah, if it wasn't for you, Flora, I'd be normal, like my father, like Henry, right? So, like, Mama, she's the, she's like the foundation. She's the floor. She's 86, and she's just getting started, right? So, like, okay, now, Mama, it's a different story. Okay, I'm like fa Papa. I'm like Papa, you know, I just, but I'm not like Papa, because I don't, I don't, not that I don't bother with it. It's just, uh, so I give it to, to you, I give it all to you, Flora, you know? I let you be the motor, usually. Well, maybe these days I'm a little more worried, because, you know, Mama's getting old, and i got to make a living. But most of my life, I devoted to you, Flora. It's because of you that the room has light, and because of you that the people are flying around, and all that crazy stuff, and all that wonderful stuff, you know? So, like, I am your shell, and you are my divine soul, floor, or something like that. So you are my spirit, and I am the body, okay? Now that's where we're at, okay? I don't even have any music. I'm just casual, like the guy in the street, you know. Hey, hey, lady, get your car off of the road here. What are you doing? I'm parked here. Look, this is my spot, you know. Or, um, how much you want for it? No, it's too much. No, look, I bought so many. Give me some money off, huh? Okay, that's me, you know, that's my gray side. Gray side, okay? So now, I'm sure glad you're around, red side. I mean, you drive me nuts. I have nothing to show for my life except for this equipment right now. Like you're there, right? So I'm giving you a lot, boy. That divine soul or whatever it is, that craziness, I've given it to you. All right, now, what do I want from you? If we're going to have a relationship, well, i got to have some objectives here. Well, let's see now. What do I want from you? I want from you... Hmm. Well... 
maybe maybe at this point I want a little bit of consideration, huh? So we can maybe uh, ha- make some 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 harmony here. I mean, set up a little bit of a life so I can at least I can hang on to my equipment and I'll be able to go on, right? So give me a little break, huh? So let's work together and have a little par- bit of a bit of parnasa, a little bit of making a living, a little bit of. On the other hand, don't worry, you'll still get most of the time, most of the energy, right? Okay, well. Well, so I am the floor, the red, loaded with vitality. I am your wonderful spiritual side, your guru. I am your Meshagas, your insane stuff. Yep. <laughs> Well, yeah, so actually, so Papa was the bourgeoisie and Papa was not, right? So, right? So you see, it's possible that the two be together and Mama's a, Mama's a very spiritual person and, and she's got, you know, she's also the musical side. Well, so we don't have to be that far apart, you know. We have a life together. As long as you understand that I am running the show or else. I am running the show, or else. So testing, there we go. I am running the show, or else, there. And now I get my true dimensions. You'd better watch out. That's even more. I can drive you bananas, Wetner. So watch out. In fact, I can even overload your equipment. I'm so nasty. But. You know, we get along. I usually play the game and we integrate, right? So like a little bit of me and a little bit of you, a little bit of yours, we'll make a musical compromise. Let's see what happens, all right? So we'll, um, 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 uh, how about, how about that now? It's a medium-sized hole, right? A little more. Give me a little more space. I need a little more space. There we go. There. Yeah, 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 yeah. Test, test, yeah. Okay, so now I got, well, we got a volume pedal. (laughs) You got a volume pedal so you can control me. See that? You figured it out. You're not that dumb, are you, Wepner? You got two sides. If you keep your foot on the volume pedal, you can shut me up. Yeah. Well, you don't even hear me. Or you can make me very loud depending on what you want, right? There we go. Now we can make some music together. Okay, so like I said, we can make music together. Like, like this is a new file here. I needed to take a break. I took a new tape. And let's see if... That's interesting, see? Hey, if we can make some music together, let's see if the idea... How does that sound? Does that sound like making music together? In other words, it's sort of like... Um, Eh, nothing very interesting, but the sounds come out. You know, like like that's how you make music. That's how you write music when you're in an uninspired mood. Very, very, you know, that tinkly chromatic stuff leads nowhere. I can't even get the notes right. This stuff is so uninteresting. Okay, now, so that's what you get from <sighs> bringing the two sides together without really getting into the struggle. It just comes out like a... Uh, eh, Nothing interesting, okay? So that's so much for the floor and the walls and that business. Now, so in this room, inside of me, are people. And the people, there's a woman and there's a man, okay? Now, the man and the woman, hmm, the man is in the air, right? Look at that. He's floating in the air. In that case, there must be some air inside of me, if I'm the room, air. Air. I have air. I'm a room with air in it. This air is kind of special. The air inside of me is something special. Look at that. That guy could just float in that air. Let's see what the air has to say. Okay? I, I'm the air. I'm all over the place. I'm here. And I'm there. Or in your corner. 
in this corner. Uh, and, then, and I'm in that corner. And I'm everywhere. I'm everywhere in the room. I fill you up, room. I'm in you all. I'm in all. All, all the corners. I'm in the high corners. I'm the low corners. I'm, I'm next to that. I'm next to that floor. When I meet the floor, man, I really get chromatic. I get, I get, I get very turned on near the floor. Very, very turned on near the near the floor. Pretty sick, sick, pretty evil. Me, you know what I mean? See me, got my see me side. And I got my see me. And I got my see me side. Pretty can be pretty fucked up. Tell you, let me tell you. And when I get near that red when I get near that red stuff, I just go bananas. I get near that red stuff. I just go bananas. Bananas. I get into that too. Let me tell you, I got into most of it the last 50 years. Ho, 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 ho. It's been one hell of a time. I can tell you stories you wouldn't believe. Ha, I've been all over the fucking place. Well, not quite. I mean, I didn't wreck myself too much like Roger did or a lot of other people. Thank God I didn't get AIDS and all that stuff. But oh, I had my flea. I mean, the red stuff. I mean, I'm not the floor. I'm not stable. I'm not stable. I'm just close the air. I do what I, I let it get to me. To I don't have any form. obligation to have a form. I can just do what I, can just do what I like when I'm there. I'm in the air. All over the place. If I want to get, want to get intoxicated, well, things go nothing. Things go nothing. I'm in the air. Can't even put your finger on me. I'll slip out away from you. Away from you. Yeah. Put that in your pipe. Put that in your pipe. Okay. Oh, yeah. See that, Papa? All your lessons and moralizing didn't do any good at all. I'm a rake and I'm in progress. Yeah, a rake in progress. <laughs> Let's soup up this air voice a little bit, I think. Let's see now. How can okay. I soup up the air voice? Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. Look. 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 Time. I, so I, I want to find a voice and it slips away. I it think you're wrong. I think I mean, it's not just you, we all small. I want it to be something, be something Frank, low, Frank, 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 but I can't Frank, quite put my Frank, finger Frank, on the voice. How about this one? Is that the voice? Is that the voice? It's me. It's me. Okay, now look, that's enough. Now I see you're going bananas in there, so I turn you off. Ha <laughs> ha, just think that you're in there all the time inside of me. Wow, no wonder it's so hard to be in this room. I am Franklin. Ephraim? Franklin? I don't know. Well, that's part of it. That's you again, your influence, right? I don't know who I am. And inside of me is this air. Or maybe it's holy ether. Maybe it's uh, Mexican jumping bees. I don't know. Pretty wild stuff, huh? And I walk around looking cool and collected to the world. They think I'm some kind of an intellectual or something like that, right? Or, well, well but actually most of them think I'm nuts anyway. So you see, I, you're the one that speaks anyway, right? You get through, right? But I mean, at least people don't know. They feel like the landlord here. I walked up to this. I walked up to the landlord with this keeper and this and this white shirt. You know, <laughs> he says, "Oh, good. Take the room here. Yeah, 
He thinks he's got a bourgeoisie, and lo and behold, look what happened. I blew his house apart. Yeah, well, well, you blew his house apart. I mean, I just got the room, but I mean, it's, well, <laughs> it's not like I fooled the guy. I mean, like, I don't know what's going to happen. How do I know what you're going to do next? I don't know what you're going to do next. Sometimes you drive me bananas all summer. I didn't know what you're going to do next. I mean, what the? Well, so I'm this room. I'm the, I'm the whole room with the walls and the floor and everything. And inside of me is this air, this ether, or this Mexican jumping bean stuff. And, and it's like entropy, you know? It just wants to go all over the place. And I am, I have the job of keeping you together, air. I keep you together. You know? I keep you square. That's it. You're square. You're here, and you're, that's it. You can only do so much. I mean, if you want to have a little curly cue, you can have that. And you can make music here and there. You can do, well, you can do stuff like... But as long as I'm running the show, and I... That's not very often, I realize. But as long as I'm running the show, you're a pretty straight guy. I keep you in a box. And that makes the two of us a jack-in-the-box. Because when the box breaks, whoop! There you go again. I'm not going to let you go now. Now you're under control. Okay. So that's the kind of world. Now, look at these people inside of me. Look at that. It's like they're trying to deal with both of us. I mean, like, well, hmm? I mean, look at them. From, I look at them from the outside. And I mean, I mean, I'm not them. I look at them from the outside. And, well, there's, on the one hand, it's a man and a woman. I mean, it's not like Matisse and all over the place and that kind of stuff. I mean, they're not Matisse. Or, or who are those people that paint all over the place? You know, just like colors and everything. But these people have forms. These are, there's a man and a woman, you know? There's a woman and that's, uh, you know, like she's got the flowers and she's doing her female stuff, right? And um, there's a guy. Looks like a guy, at least. <laughs> he looks sort of like a guy. He doesn't have any arms or anything, but still, it's like a man. Like, and he's here to say hello. Or maybe he's her husband or a boyfriend or something. But um, basically, you know, he's um, a man. He's like, um, no, he's got a deep... He's a man doing his thing, you know? The man. Okay, the man, stop, a man. Just a man and a woman in a room. Nothing special, but... Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, there's a lot of people wrote about this stuff already, but... Okay, well, let's go on. So, it's about, um, it's about the air, and it's about the floor. Like, uh, that's the, the motor. And the rest of us watch and wait for those moments, huh? Sometimes they come, and sometimes we settle down to... <laughs> humdrum existence that just go on and on and on and I sit here and I practice and I think about getting gigs and oh but then the moments come and I write my music and I do my fiery creative stuff and uh I suppose I'm not as fiery as I used to be but I still hope there'll be these moments of fire <laughs> fire burning 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 a shtetl that burns and just a, a life that, a life that's on fire. There's something to that. A life on fire, a life on fire. Well, anyway, let's see what these people have to say. Okay? Fine. So, now, I am a woman. I am in a house, in a room, and I'm putting flowers somewhere. I'm not quite sure where because, actually, if you look at the table there, it doesn't make too much sense. But, all right. I'm putting stuff maybe in that cup, I don't know, maybe, I don't see where I'll put the flowers, but anyway, so I'm busy putting flowers somewhere. I'm wearing a black, my new dress outfit, and white. I look kind of conventional, right? My hair is curled. I must look like uh, people used to look in those days, right? Maybe 19, uh, no, actually this is, yeah, 1900 in Russia, right, something like that. Small town, and uh, there's this man here, and of course I like this guy, I don't know, maybe he's my husband, maybe he's my boyfriend, and I see he's really freaked out. I mean, like, I'm floating too, but this guy is nuts. I mean, look at him, wow, look at him go, I don't mind, I mean, I get kind of caught up in his energy, you know, like, 
Ah, it's partly the room, of course, the colors, you know, they're so bright. That red, wow, and oh, look at the watermelon, look at those pits, look at that red pits. Well, you know, red furniture, I gotta have the flower. And look at that pillow, my pillow. How do you like my furniture? Stuff like that. I mean, I bought all this shit, you know. I Look at this. Excuse me, I shouldn't say stuff like that. I'm really a very nice person. I bought these. This is this furniture. I bought that red table, and I bought that red... I painted the floor red, or I had somebody do it, and I... Uh, that's my red uh, pillow, and that's my red uh, bed... bed uh, what do you call it? Blanket or something? So I guess I like red, huh? I guess I have that red side, but look at my outfit. I'm black, white, stum, just so like I put it into the walls, you know. I put it into the air around me. And he comes in and wow, you know, he sees me and he knows from the room. He would never guess it from me, but from the room, what he knows what's going on here. Maybe that's what's going on, huh? So what do I want from him? I want I don't know what the story is, because I'm black and white and ordinary, and I don't know. I like I like this guy. That's what I like about this guy. Like he really lets it hit him. He lets himself go bananas. And I love to go along for the ride. I sure do, man. When I get into bed, oh, 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 oh. I mean, I myself, you know, I don't, you would never guess it. <laughs> I look kind of ordinary, but well, when this guy just gives me an excuse, you know, like it just, he gets me started, you know, and I just, oh man, I don't stop. I just don't stop. I mean, like, wow. I don't stop. I don't stop. I really groove. I groove. I mean, like, here it is, you know, like, I'm at his place, sometimes at my place. I like, what, do I, what if I was at his place? And it doesn't take long to get started. <laughs> I just walk in, and he, he comes over, and I just, <laughs> I let it happen, you know. I just, I just let it happen. I go along. I know what he wants, and what he wants is, I guess, what I want. I mean, I don't know, but I mean, I just feel it's like that air, you know, in the room, and I just go along with it, just, oh, oh there he goes, he's starting it, he's coming, oh, 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 God, oh, he's giving me an excuse, I don't have to be black and white, thank you so much, I don't have to be black and white, I can be any color I want, like especially, I can be red, I can be red in bed, I can be very red, in bed, red, in bed, I can, yeah, I, I sure can, I can be very red in bed. So where was I in my fantasy? Oh yes, oh so, so anyway, so he got, he's, oh, oh my gosh, I start, he start, I, I can't breathe, he starts, I have to, I have to swallow, swallow a lot i just <laughs> he's he's doing exactly what i told him to do how to do it i mean like he knows how to do it and he's doing exactly what i he, he's doing he's got me here and he's got me there and he's rubbing this oh he's sucking on that oh just don't stop just don't don't stop yeah i'm coming I, i'm going i'm coming yeah i'm with you yeah i'm with you i'm with you yeah yeah i'm with you buddy just don't 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 stop oh don't stop don't stop don't stop don't stop don't stop don't stop yeah yeah oh my god well <laughs> so i got to the end of the tape there you know and i'm sorry you know i was telling you about that moment you know like we got it together and 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 the tape ended. I just wanted to tell you about it, but I got cut off. And suddenly I realized the tape was over. So I got to be careful. This time I'm going to watch carefully. 22 minutes. Let's see now. 20, 22 minutes. All right. So anyway, so I was telling you that like, you know, about like getting there and 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 then get get really get to that moment, you know, really special. I'm not going to try and do it again because it's lost. It's on. It wasn't recorded. But anyway, I got to the point where I was really high and I said, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, you know, when I was finished and I was sitting back thinking about it afterwards, and then, you know, I started thinking about my canary. I got a canary. And the canary also, it's like me and the canary the canary, and like no one would guess, looking at me and my canary, me in my black and white outfit, and the canary, 
that we have this special, special place deep down in our, I don't know if it's deep down in our hearts or our souls or our crotch or what, but like I got a real special place and I'm so glad that this guy comes along and knows how to get to that place because without him, well, without you guy, I'm just black and white, right? So like I'm really grateful that you come to me and I come with you, right? <laughs> mm, good. Oh, you know, as I tell you this story, this is Franklin speaking, as I tell you this story, I get nostalgic because I'll tell you a secret. <laughs> that whole story about the woman, I was using a memory of somebody I know. I guess I shouldn't tell you who it is, but that actually happened. I mean, like, of course, I was the guy, but I mean, like, it really happened that way. And, you know, thinking about it makes me wonder Maybe she misses. I, I wonder if, if maybe I should call her tonight. She's very far away, and she's very much in her box with her canary, and that's it, you know? I don't think she'd come out of her box long distance. She probably needs me to be there, and I'm here, and it's probably too late, because you know what? It was about how many years ago, that magic moment. That magic moment when the red and the ordinary come together, and the canary had something to do with it because the canary was her redness, her Michigas. I mean, like, what's this broad doing with a canary when she should have a, a life? Instead, she's got a fucking canary. In other words, she's whacked up, right? But that's what makes her interesting, that dialectical tension, you know, like the red and the right, the red and, and the gray struggling together makes her a jack-in-the-box like me, a jack-in-the-box like me. And then the jack-in-the-box opens up, and we, the spring goes, you like it, just whoop, 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 and then whoop, and then the spring goes in the wind, and that's such a trip, man, blowing in the wind together. Well, so maybe I'll call her. Hmm, too early yet. Maybe I'll call her later. <sighs> I miss that redness. I've been pretty gray lately. I've been very gray lately, very square. Where's the canary? I need a canary. I need my canary. You were my canary, and I was your canary. Thank you. So what do we get from this? What do I need? I need to be a jack-in-the-box with another jack-in-the-box with a canary, and this, the rest of it, the high notes are the canary. It's like the sting on the scorpion. It's on the end of his tail, you know. That's what makes a scorpion interesting. Otherwise, he'd be just, you know, and all that shit, which is boring. So thank God for the canary and the sting on the scorpion. Yeah, thank God for the canary and the sting on the scorpion. Thank God for the sting on the scorpion and the canary. Thank God for the sting on the scorpion and the canary. Thank God for the sting on the scorpion and the canary. Otherwise, it would be a bore, a real bore. Ch -ch -ch -ch, a bore. Hmm. Well, so, so I'm this guy, and I'm wearing a green shirt. And I'm floating in the air And I'm really going with it And I'm so twisted around Because my sweetie's here She's my focus I'm the canary I know that I have a power To unlock canaries And canary types Which includes just about everybody It includes you, motherfucker I can unlock your canary Got it? It's nice to be appreciated. I'm like a time bomb. I walk in and the clock stops. Starts, going, starts, or is it stops? It's like a different time. It's like messianic time, you know? I walk in, great expectations, you know? I mean, like, whatever you're doing, it doesn't matter, because I'm here. And if you don't get that message, well, then you don't matter, because I'm not here anymore. Got it? Like, here I am, sweetie. See me? See that? You can't look at anything else. So you must be the right one, cause you know that I know that you know that I got what I need, and what you not, I got what you need, and we got, and I'm in a, I'm a catalyst, and, and, you know, there's something inexorable about me, I keep going, there's something inexorable about me, I just keep going, in fact that, in that respect, I'm sort of like dead, I mean like, I get going, and it's like a, it's like a 
said, you know, it's like a stereo, you know, that sand and they go up the river, you know, like they don't stop, you know, till they get there. And then it's like the death toll, death no, death no toll, the knell, the bell. I mean, you know, it's like you hear it, you hear that bell, right? It's like, it's like, it's like a clock, a time bomb, but it's also like, like a church bell. You know what I mean? It's like, like the end of the line. You get into that groove and baby, you know, it's like, you know, and you're, you're not young anymore and you, you go together and, you know, it's like leading us down, down to the other end of the, of the existential continuum. Like, 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 like we're gonna die and grow old together and all that stuff. But, but that's nice. You, it's nice to be on that trip with somebody and, and I miss it because she left, you know, she left and I haven't found another canary yet. Maybe I never will. I mean, there were several in the past, but it's getting harder to find canaries. So anyway, so we were doing this work. So anyway, baby, look. Okay, so I see your flowers, but the flowers aren't important. What's important is me and you, and you know, it's like me and you, baby. It's like you and me, baby. It's like you and me, baby. We're gonna have a good time together, just you and me, baby. I'm like the air all over the place around here now. Well, you get the message, huh? So then she says, well... <laughs> Glad you're here, huh? I got my flowers to take care of, but, uh, and uh, I see you. In fact, I don't see anything else right now. It's like, I mean, like my feet are on the ground. My feet are on the ground, but you know, like, oh, there we go. There I go again. Oh, 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 I, I'm only one foot on the ground now. <laughs> only one foot on the ground now, I mean. Like, who's going to pay the rent with you and your nutty ideas? You'll never make a living, you schmuck. You schmuck. How dare you come to my house, you schmuck. But, 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 thank you for coming to my house because I'm such a jack-in-the-box and I don't know how to get out and I'm locked in my box. So thank you, you fucking devil. Thank you for coming to my house because I'm too much of a gray person and a white person. So... <sighs> We can be beautiful for a few moments and then I'll have to kick you out because I gotta get, get, I gotta get back to work, you know. I gotta get up in the morning and go to my job. Baby, now look, I don't buy it anymore. You hear that bell? That's our bell. We're moving together this time and this time you're not gonna throw me out because I'm not gonna leave. You got it. This time we will stay together because... Okay, you're right, yes, I hear you, yeah, I hear you, yeah, I'm coming, yes, yes, just don't stop, yeah, I'm coming, yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you, yes, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, oh, 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 yeah, yes, 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 don't stop, don't stop, yeah, yes, don't stop, no, no, baby, don't forget it, don't forget it, don't forget it, don't forget it, baby, don't forget it, baby, I am the one you need to get out of your box, I am the one to release you from your jack in the box, so remember that, yes, you, you understand, do you understand, do you understand, do you remember that, do you remember that, just remember what I'm telling you, and don't forget next time when it's finished you will...